the whole thing wobbing. What is going on guys? It is Xerxy coming at you today with another YouTube video and today we have a list of literally every single confirmed legend in Madden 19. Now, I do want to give a big shout out to Sports Gamers Online. These screenshots were taken from his video. I did ask for his permission and he did give me permission to take some screenshots and show you guys. Now, I did have another video. Uh, it was in-game screenshots and that video was from IMAB, which I also took screenshots from that to show you guys what legends were in that. But it turns out we actually have an entire depth chart to go over. So literally every single legend that you guys will be seeing in this will be an ultimate team obviously if they have the rights to use them and play now they're gonna go ahead and use them in ultimate team. so let's go ahead and go through literally every single confirmed legend that we have men 19 so starting off with the qbs now you guys can see we have three qbs we also have the kicker and the punter but we have steve young dan marino we also have michael vick and then of course for the kickers we have anderson and guy so, Steve Young, a 99 overall, obviously. Mike Vick, only a 91, uh, surprisingly. Now, of course, the overalls doesn't matter. That's their play now overall. That is obviously not going to be their ultimate team overall. That'd be definitely crazy if, like, a 99 Steve Young right off the bat. But Steve Young, Dan Marino, and Mike Vick, obviously confirmed. In Madden 19, will we see Mike Vick right off the start? I don't think so. Uh, I feel like they're probably going to hold off on him and wait until later in the game so that like his price would be kind of higher and he'd be more uh valuable and of course people living more coins would probably try to pull for him but on to the running backs you guys can see we have barry sanders ladanian tomlinson and also terrell davis so uh we already knew about terrell davis we did not confirm ladanian tomlinson and barry sanders which of course if you guys know anything about uh ladanian tomlinson this year he was the token master. Uh, I think that's just kind of what it's called, the token master. But you can get him all the way to a 99 overall. And I think they might do something like this again next year. Would well, definitely be pretty interesting to see exactly which player they decide to do with. But for the running backs, I think we have a pretty good backfield to start off with. With Barry Sanders, Lanny Thomas, and Terrell Davis. I kind of wish we had uh, Walter Payton in the game. I really, really hope that Walter Payton is in Madden 19. He wasn't in Madden 18, surprisingly, so I don't know if they lost the rights to him or what. But on to the fullbacks, we have Lorenzo Neal and Franco Harris. Now, uh, from the gameplay video, I knew there was a sharp. And you guys can see here from the fullback depth list, for some reason, he's fullback number three. Shannon Sharp, it does say tight end. I didn't know if it was Sterling Sharp or Shannon Sharp, and it looks like we do have Shannon Sharp in the game confirmed at the tight end. But Lorenzo Neal and Franco Harris, obviously Lorenzo Neal was the fullback, the lead blocker kind of for Ladanian Tomlinson, so definitely nice to have him in the game. On to the wide receivers, and this is where it gets pretty dang fun. Now, I got to say, this is a stacked a uh, wide receiver course so of course you have jerry rice and 99 overall at wide receiver number one now we also have randy moss terrell owens chris carter and tim brown now Deion sanders is also down there wide receiver number six kind of funny that he's there but the fact that we have that good of a receiving core right off the start is definitely very nice of course they're going to spread it out they won't get all these guys right off the bat of man 19 but it's just the guys we can definitely look forward to seeing in the game so tim brown kind of more of a slot receiver uh chris carter was in the beginning of the game this year so very possible he's in the beginning of the game next year usually they wait on people like jerry rice randy moss uh terrell owens of course the madden 19 cover athlete at least for the hall of fame edition so you know he's gonna be the game and he might have a base a legend edition right off the bat as well now into the tight ends we have tony gonzalez shannon shannon sharp yes shannon sharp and also kellen winslow which kellen winslow's son need to get him in check that boy is facing a whole lot of different charges like burglary or burglary can't really say the word for some dang reason but you guys get the point uh, also like just some really messed up stuff not going to go into it with some older women we'll just leave it at that but definitely not uh <laughs> some good news for his son uh kellen winslow sharp and tony gonzalez for the tight ends definitely pretty nice uh speed on him 84 obviously 
Tony Gonzalez, you think you'd have a little bit faster speed. Strength of 74, definitely not too bad, but a nice little offensive group. Now, onto the offensive lineman, we have Jonathan Ogden at left tackle. We also have Anthony Munoz and Anderson at right tackle. Now, I think that obviously you shouldn't be here at left tackle, but Munoz and Jonathan Ogden at the left tackle position. Definitely pretty good. Uh, two pretty solid offensive linemen. On to the left guards, you guys can see we have Steve Hutchinson, we also have Randall McDaniel at left guards, now on to the center, we have Kevin Maway, we have Dawson, and Munoz is here as well for the left tackle for the Bengals, of course, for some reason, is the number three center, but Dawson, of course, uh, I don't remember, I think it's Dimitri, the, I know he's probably the Steelers, I don't remember his first name, but I think it's Dimitri, but definitely not too bad for the offensive line, on to the right guard, you guys can see we have Larry Allen, and it looks like he's the only right guard that we have confirmed for Madden 19 in terms of ultimate team anyways. So it looks like we only have one right guard to start off Madden 19. Now to the right tackles, we have Willie Rofe and also Anderson. So basically we have two offensive linemen of every position except for right guard, which is a little bit weird that we don't have a right guard. But on to the right ends, actually, almost the left ends. On to the right ends, you guys can see, starting off, we have the sack master himself, Bruce Smith. We also have Howie Long, so two pretty decent right ends right off the bat. Uh, Michael Strahan, you guys can see there, who, of course, is going to be in the next picture, which will be left end. And starting off that, we have Reggie White, of course. Can't have anybody else here, Reggie White. And, of course, Michael Strahan. So, we have some pretty good uh, sack machines to start off the year Madden 19. Hopefully, all these guys are pretty beastly cards. Come Madden Ultimate Team. But on to the next position, we have defensive tackles, which you can't have a defensive tackle. But mean Joe Green. That guy was absolutely amazing in Ultimate Team this year. If you guys played the Super Bowl Edition card, was disgusting. Ultimate Legend was definitely very nice. And, of course, we also have John Randall, who's kind of more of a speedster. Uh, defensive tackle, but it actually looks like Minjo Green has more speed. Kind of interesting right there, but it also looks like we have Young. I think a defensive tackle. I can't really read it too well, but I'm pretty sure this says Young. Uh, and also, you guys can see basically the entire death chart there is just sitting there at defensive tackle. So that is basically the entire defensive line. A pretty solid uh, defensive unit. As you guys can see for the middle linebackers, though, we have Ray Lewis and Brian Erlacher at the starting two middle linebackers. Of course, Derek Brooks and Kevin Green with Lawrence Taylor and Demarcus Ware next up. So, of course, right at the linebackers, we have Lawrence Taylor and, of course, Brooks with also Green at left us a linebacker. And going over to the cornerbacks now, you guys can see that we have Deion Sanders. You can't really have a defense without Deion Sanders. I mean, unless you want to get pancaked everywhere, then, I mean, I guess you, you definitely need Dion if you want to get pancaked. Not in an overall Dion Sanders. We also have Rod Woodson, Mel Blunt, Champ Bailey, and Ed Reed, who for some reason is listed at cornerback position. Of course, he is a free safety, and he's just like their depth chart type cornerback. But definitely some pretty nice corners that they have. Dion, Rod Woodson, Mel Blunt. Uh, two of those guys can actually get off a block. Dion Sanders and Champ Bailey. Not the absolute best at that, but on to the free safety. You guys can see we have Ronnie Lott, Brian Dawkins, or actually not Brian Dawkins, Ed Reed. For some reason, I was thinking Brian Dawkins because I see him uh, on the next page, but you guys can see, or actually he's right there. We you guys can see we have Ronnie Lott, Ed Reed, and Paul Cross. So that's a pretty solid free safety core. Now I think... Or actually, I'm pretty positive. Madden 18, he's listed as strong safety, so I'm not really too sure why he's a free safety in Madden 19, but maybe they'll change that in Ultimate Team, or maybe they'll just keep it a free safety. I think they change it around like every couple of years. But on to the strong safeties, which Brian Dawkins is listed here in strong safety number one, and Steve Atwater, who in Madden 19, or Madden 18, are both free safeties. So that's kind of strange, but Brian Dawkins and Steve Atwater are going to round out this list. Now, also, we have Morton Anderson, which I think might have been on the QB picture. Actually, he was, but that is who I couldn't figure out who number seven was in my other video for the Legends. But once again, big shout out to Sports Gamer Online. A link to his channel will be in the description. I hope you guys did enjoy the video, and if I get any more news on Madden 19, any Legends we have coming out, new Ultra Team information, anything like that, 
I will be sure to drop a video on that, so make sure you hit that sub button, subscribe, and comment. Also, turn the notification bell on so you guys get notified whenever I upload a video like this. If you guys want to check out any of my merchandise, there is a link in the description. Make sure you guys go ahead and check that out. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.